Class. Okay, that's what I did. Hi, it's me, narrator man. It had been two hours in this group meeting for Alina's business project. A lot of discussion and research had happened, but the paper still needed a lot of work, and Lena was tired. So I finished my group meeting. It was around three hours long, but we got a lot of stuff done. Um, we just have to do some things on our own, and I'm finally getting home. I have some food, and I'm gonna prep for my acting audition, and then work on this group project, but that's what's happening. Honestly, this is seriously one of the best things you can ever see as a student. I am so happy to be done. Okay, so I'm just heading to my first class and I have a presentation there where I'm actually getting there a little bit early just to at least go through it once with my group. And yeah. I just parked for my audition in the studio. It's literally right in front of me. So I'm gonna go audition. Hopefully things go well. I'm kind of nervous about this one. Um, we'll see what happens and I'll, I'll vlog a little more later. Okay, I just finished my audition and I feel like it went well. Now it's just a matter of crossing my fingers and hoping that I'm the right fit for the part and the project and whatnot. But I did really like it and I think it worked out well, a lot better than I kind of expected because I do get a, like really nervous when there's like singing involved. But I think, I think it went well. I'm so tired and honestly, I really wanted to take a nap, but I somehow got myself to actually walk to class. <sighs> okay, so I'm just walking there. So I finished lecture and the main topic today was death, which really isn't the greatest thing to think about. But lecture was still great because we found out that we had an extension for a project that was originally due Thursday and now it's due Sunday, which is honestly so, so great. And I stopped to get some coffee, which I usually never drink. It usually gives me headaches and I don't really love the taste of it. But I really, I was just really weirdly craving the taste of coffee for some reason. And I really do need the caffeine because I am so freaking tired. Um, but now I'm just sitting at the park with my coffee and I'm just relaxing because I guess I have the time now that that deadline was moved. So I'm just going to sit here for a little bit. I'll show you what my view looks like. <laughs> Don't copyright me, okay? The songs are 
in for less than three seconds. Please and thank you. It's time to work out. Yay. I'm gonna do this one twice and I'm not gonna have fun doing it. Owie. Come on, you can do it. No pain, no gain. Let's go. Okay, so I've just been doing some work and I took my makeup off as you can probably tell my acne is really not doing well this week. It's been a stressful time. And now I'm just about to participate in an online study for extra credit. We love extra credit. Uh, yeah. Okay, good morning. I had a really terrible sleep last night. <laughs> but I'm still going to class, even though I feel sick. Um, I look like an egg today. That's all. So after class, I was planning to get lunch and eat it outside because I knew that it was going to be a really beautiful day today, and it is. And then I was going to go to the library, do some work there, and then go to the store. Uh, but I got my period this morning. Yay, Mother Nature! This really shouldn't be a taboo subject to talk about <laughs> because it happens every month to a lot of women. So uh, my first day symptoms are usually really terrible, and today is not an exception. My legs are cramping up a lot, my cramps are terrible, I have nausea, I just feel really, really fatigued. So I think I'm just gonna make lunch here uh, and maybe do some work here and have more Advil and then I'll figure out the rest of my life. It literally feels like there's someone constantly punching my legs and my like abdomen and it's hurting I feel like that ouch why are periods even a thing all right so I took some of this earlier and it was honestly so so helpful it really got rid of a lot of things that were going on. My legs still kind of hurt, but uh, I'm doing so much better. And my friend Maria asked me if I was going grocery shopping today because I have a car so she doesn't have to buzz over there. And I figured I do need to buy a few things, so I'm gonna drive us both to go get a few things. <laughs> Okay, it's a bit later and uh, the club that I'm a part of, the UBC Photo Society, we're having a gallery tomorrow. So I'm helping like set up all the pictures around our studio and that's what I'm currently gonna go do. <laughs> I just realized I forgot to vlog any of what I did this evening. I didn't really do much, just had dinner, then worked on some on a paper, and then watched some Netflix, and then kept working, and now it's one in the morning, and I do have pimple cream on, cause skincare. And now I'm gonna go to sleep. Wait, I gotta put this to charge. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, so I'm walking to my first class and we're not really doing anything. It's just presentations today. And since I presented last time, I'm not doing anything, but you do get uh, like attendance marks. So that's what I'm gonna go do. So I'm just going to go to the library and get some work done. They we're freaking renovating my favorite study spot in that library and the only study spaces open are the ones in the basement. So I'm crossing over to the other library. Okay, so it's about dinner time and I'm just having dinner with a few friends. We're just making some salmon lettuce wraps and her building is literally right across from mine. So I'm just walking across the street. So I'm just in the psychology building. I'm participating in another extra credit study. Um, and then I have an audition right after this that I'm gonna have to really, really rush to. Hopefully this ends a little bit early, um, but yeah. Okay, so the study did end a bit earlier, just like I thought it would, which is great because now I don't have to rush to my audition. So I'm gonna go drive over there. Okay, so I finished the audition. All I had to do was just tell them my name and tell them something about myself and that was it. So in a very nice and easy commercial audition, hopefully I get a call back and hopefully I get booked because I need some money, I'm broke. two auditions today I just finished up the first one and then I have this gap between the other one the places are kind of close so it doesn't make sense for me to go back home between them so I think I'm just gonna go sit in a Starbucks and grab something to eat and maybe do some work I brought my laptop <laughs> Just walking. 
walking to my second audition and it's such a nice day. It's like 17 degrees or something, 16, I don't know, it's so nice and sunny. It's freaking four in the morning. Are you kidding? Okay, it is 4.30 in the morning now, and they finally let us back in the building. It was a false alarm, and I'm going the frick to sleep to whoever pulled it. Why? Okay, it is Sunday, and it is really sunny and nice today, and I'm gonna go meet a friend. He's actually, like, he used to be my neighbor back in second year, and he hasn't been at UBC for some time. He's just been, like, working, so I'm gonna go see him. My name's Charlie, and my Tim Hortons order is a single-single, not a double-double. Okay, so I finished meeting up with my friend Charlie, and he's honestly such a nice, cool person. Charlie, if you're watching this, I'm really grateful that I met you in second year, and that you were my neighbor, and that we actually started talking. Uh, yeah, now I'm just going back home to write an essay that is due at midnight, and that I've barely started, because procrastination. Okay, this is a great way to end the week. What a friggin' last couple stressful hours. Let me just, let me just flip the camera over. So my assignment was due at 11.59 and I submitted it at 11.55. Oh my God, I'm still stressed. Do not procrastinate, kids. Do not.